to Steph. His three. To be able to be in a place where I can uh, host my own camp for kids in the city I grew up in um, is pretty remarkable. It's still kind of sur surreal to me. Y'all excited about this week? Yeah! I can't hear you. Yeah! All right, all right. We're at day one of the Stephen Curry Skills Academy um, in my alma mater, Charlotte Christian High School. So. It's a great opportunity to you know, bring some of the local kids out and, and teach them some of the you know, fundamentals of basketball. Uh, we have a lot of great coaches here that are you know, donating their time to, to take these kids through the drills that I do during the summer. High knees! High knees! High knees! High knees! High knees! Real slow, hands up. Keep going, let's go, let's go. Stay low, stay low. Yo, shot! Yo, shot! Ball! I want to know, like, what's the one thing you want to get out of camp this week? And what's the one thing you, you want to get better at? Um, um, put, you're putting you on the spot. I want to get better at ball handling. Ball handling, all right. Defense. Deep. My man. You're the first person to actually say <laughs> I grew up going to those kind of camps and learned a lot about the game, going to my dad's camps and uh, just being in that basketball atmosphere and that learning atmosphere. And so to... When you get into that situation, it's kind of natural for me to just speak about how, what I, how I see the game and different things that they should know to take the game to the next level. You don't want to be thinking about the ball, right? There's so many other things you have to think about, so many other decisions you have to make. It's kind of cool to see him as a mentor to them and how much they look up to him and how much they learn. And He's a great public speaker. Um, so just the, just the, you are, you're good, you're really good. So the talks that he gives to them and, and just the advice that he gives to them, it's really cool to see and to see the kids take what he says and actually put it into action. Confidence has to stay up here no matter how the game goes. Good job, good job. If you go back to that step, keep your knees up, keep your knees up. You go to chicken leg. I learned that from my dad. He gave so many speeches growing up, and I'd sit there in the the group with the rest of the kids and and hear him talk. And so he's a big influence when it comes to just basketball lessons, but also how that translates into life lessons. I had some great coaches along the way as well. Um, you know, my coach at that high school that hosted the camp. Um, my alma mater, Coach Sean Brown, who was a big mentor for me, and Coach McKillop in my, my college at Davidson also. So, and now even Coach Jackson, the way that he talks about, you know, life and faith and basketball and how it all intertwines. It's, uh, I got some guys that have done the same for me too. So why not pay it forward, as they, yeah. as they say. All right, who can name the starting lineup <laughs> for the Charlotte Knights. We don't know that. All right, who can name the starting lineup this season? The, the lineup that started the most games for the Golden State Warriors this year. All right. I'll work on three. One, two, three. Five, five, work. One, two, three. Five, five, work. One, two, three. Five, five, work. There you go. <laughs>